number one at 11. King 5 News starts now. Leave it to Seattle, the glass capital of the nation, to come up with the ultimate resting space. Colorful, hand-blown glass cremation urns are true works of art, aimed at taking the creep factor out of their display. Dude, I got hit bad by that glass bug. Working near a hot oven is nothing new to artist Mike Holberg. He was a baker for 30 years before he turned his glass hobby into a career, with a twist. Last year, two women asked him if he had art glass urns for their dearly departed. He didn't. And at that point, I was thinking to myself, maybe I should make some cremation urns. The result? True works of art, holding up to 300 cubic inches of remains. The, the cool thing about these are, you'll put this up on the shelf. There you have your work of art. Nobody's going to come in and look at it and go, hey, who's in there? The only requirement for what Holberg calls his personal temples is that they have a lid. You know, this one you know, could actually hold up to three or four sets of remains. You could put your whole family in this one. Holberg couldn't pick a better place to ply his creations. In 2005, Washington had the second highest cremation rate in the country, 64 percent, compared to a national average of 30.8 percent. Prices range from just under $1,000 to 6000 Holberg says it makes for interesting cocktail party conversation. Yeah, yeah you do get the looks, and, and then you get the, not only the look, the really odd look like, what? You know? Holberg will hold an open, uh, opening show of his personal temples tomorrow night at Viscosity Glass Studios in Seattle's Columbia City neighborhood. For more information, just go to king5.com and click news links. This is King 5.